Welcome to Tanaka in three, two, one. Get more sleep. In a South China Morning Post September 16th article, Howard Yu says creativity is just connecting things. Apple's Steve Jobs once said, "When you ask creative people how they did something, they feel a little guilty because they didn't really do it. They just saw something." Plentiful sleep is a major factor in this, for sleep helps in the seeing and connecting. I'm sure you've heard and probably experienced yourself that the lack of sleep is a big modern-day issue. What contributes to this is companies don't really address it. In fact, in many ways, they encourage it. At the very least, ignore it. Number one, sleep deprivation not only stifles creativity; it impairs judgment. Makes you forgetful, dumbs you down, and can lead to serious health issues. One of the biggest improvements you can make in your life is in your control: sleep. It needs to be a top priority in your professional and personal lifestyle. Number two, smart bosses realize that being present in the workplace affects better decision making. What better way to be present than being properly rested? You've been in meetings where some member's eyes are glazed over, or you see the head bobs trying to stay awake. This lack of presence from key stakeholders can generate a less effective decision on the discussed issue, since those head bobbers are not contributing their important information. Leaders, your people need to be present. Number three, the obvious question is how to get more sleep. There are many suggestions, such as don't drink alcohol just before going to bed, or not looking at your blue screen before nodding off, etc., etc. They are all useful suggestions, but they don't get to the core issue. You just need to go to bed earlier. In the immortal words of my former employer, the most effective technique to get more sleep is to just do it. But why do we delay our sleep? Do we really think that staying up late to watch TV or a sporting event contributes to our well-being? Do we think that working late every night will drive greater results? Let's say, on average, you work 75 hours a week. If you worked two less hours, would you see a significant reduction in your output? No. If you worked three less, nope. But if you spent those two to three hours getting a good night's rest, it would make a huge difference. You're simply shifting hours from where it makes no difference to where it will have a significant impact. That's leverage. That's control. How to find those two to three hours? Actually, there's no need to find them. Just take them. Therefore, tonight, choose to go to sleep earlier. Good night. Take action. Make a difference. You want more? Check out www.lancetanakagroup.com. Mm-hmm.